Welcome back to my YouTube channel. This is Outlook 2021 tutorial. In this tutorial, I'll be discussing on how to create an email signature in your Outlook. So an email signature is a block of text you can attach to the end of an email message. You can, it, it, you can, it, it can be added manually or automatically with a simple click of a button. So your signature is typically your name and your contact information, but it can include other information such, information such as your company logo or your social media handles or links. So to create, to create your own email signature from the message tab, what we need to do is we need to go to the include group here. Here you can see there's a message tab, here is the include group and you can see we have a signature here. But if I just click on this drop down list, you can see we don't have any signature we've created in the past, so we cannot insert a signature. But we can actually click on signature to create new signature. Here, by clicking the signature, it takes me to the signature and stationery. And here at this moment, you can see we have the select signatures to edit. So at this moment, we don't have any signature we've created in the past. So the only option we can actually do now, right now, is to create a new signature. So just click new. So by clicking new, I can just kill, let me just call this signature. Let me just give this my name and call this Kelvin, and then hit enter. Okay. So at this moment, you can see that our signature is empty. So we need to actually enter the information of our signature. So let me just enter the information. And here is the information I want to enter for the signature. So if you think that the, the, the information is correct, we can actually modify this in, um, information. But for example, I can change the font of the kind regards and just change it to a different font I wish so let me just scroll down a little bit and change that so we can actually change let me just for example I can decide to change the to a different color let me just change that to like for example to green and then leave it that way and then change this as well to a different color to like blue so after entering, after entering the information you want to actually add to your signature, here you can see it says choose the default signature. So for example, if I sent a new message, I want, to, I want this signature to be automatically included in that message. So I can decide to select Kelvin. And for the reply, I can actually create a new signature. You want to save the changes you made to Kelvin? Yes. Then let me just create another one. Call this reply. And then say okay and here we can just say we just put kind regards Calvin and I'm going to select the reply I'm going to select this for the reply so after entering all the information then what you need to do right now is to click OK so by clicking OK if I go back again to my signature you can see we now have two options or more options to actually include our signature in this email we are trying to compose so I can just hit the Kelvin you can see it has been added but mind you this is the kind regard of actually was not that it's, it's not it's not being shown very well so what i can actually do is i can actually just go back again to my signature and under the kelvin i can decided to modify this and just change this to a standard and then let me just remove this so i can go back again to my signature and just hit kelvin and you can see we now have a kind regards which seems more better than what it was before but let me just cancel this and if I try to actually create um, a new email compose an, a new email so if I just hit new email here you can see automatically my signature have been added or if I try to reply an email that was sent to me let me go to an email and just try to reply to Sandra and I hit the reply automatically you can see that my signature have been added to this reply but if we want to actually modify our signature, we can actually do that in a different way. For example, if you don't have the um, a new email open, new to actually compose the email open, we can just go to File. On that file, we can go to Options, and from the Options Outlook Options, click on Mail. And here you can see we have the option Create or Modify Signatures for Messages. So just click Signature automatically it will take you to the signature and stationery. so here we can actually decide to actually modify our signature and the reply also we can say do you want to save i can say yes so we can actually modify or edit the reply signature as well and then after everything has been 
modified or edited just click ok and then click ok again so this is how you create an email signature or modify an email signature in outlook 2021 Thank you very much for taking your time to watch this video and please don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel for more IT tutorials. Bye.